was so surprised when he gave this to me. I was thinking he would not marry me when he makes it in life. Look at you. You woman of little faith. I know my brother very well. You are all he breathes. My dear, I'm very happy for you. <laughs> huh? Yes. Please say that again. Yeah, you are you. all he breathes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. So that means you. wedding bells is going to ring pretty soon, right? Yes, you can say that again, my <laughs> sister-in-law. <laughs> Just say it louder, on a louder note, wedding bells soon. <laughs> Wait until you see me in my sexy bridesmaid's dress. And who said you're going to be my bridesmaid? Hmm? Uh -uh. You know, I have this very close friend of mine who was my classmate. So she's going to be my maid of honor. Then I have some other friends who are going to be my bridal train. And then, mm -mm, maybe you'll do my cake. Hey, whoa! <laughs> And then my mommy will cook for me. I'll probably give some other person the duty to get my ashibi materials. Mm. Ah, no, 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 no. <laughs> so you are welcome. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> I want to apologize for the land dispute that I caused uh, before I left the, uh, the village for the city. I'm, I'm really very sorry. Honestly, I did not mean to uh, do that. It's just that. I needed that money, you know, so I could move, you know, like a man and, and hustle. Because all my mates were doing well in the city, you know, and you know, I said, let me, let me try, you know. So that, that was why I did what I did. I am really very sorry. Yes. Um, I've already settled the issue with my uncle. Oh, that's very nice. That's very good of you. Uh, you know, when I heard that you go to the city, I know that you go there and make it. And you have made it. Oh, I'm very proud of you. This community is very proud of you. Igwe, <laughs> <laughs> thank you very much. Uh, I, I did not come empty-handed. Really? For being proud of me, Igwe. I gave you check you. This is for you, Igwe. Right. Yeah. Thank you very much, my son. Thank you very much. When next you are coming to this village, let me know. And name the chief tenancy title you want me to confide on you. And I will do that immediately. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> Thank you very much. You're, you're welcome. Yes, um, yeah, I appreciate it. Uh, Igwe, I have to take my leave now. Yes, you know, um, rich men are always very busy. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> uh, Alright, uh, take care. Who's <laughs> you? You get me that money. Get me that money immediately. Amara, you look so beautiful. So finally, Uzo got married to you. Uh -uh. Hmm? See this girl, you're in my husband's house. And you're saying so you finally got married to Uzo. I told you. I told you that Uzo belongs to me and me alone. I can see that. And what are you, Uzo? I cannot drag him with anybody at all, at all. Listen, Mary. Without Uzo, I cannot leave you. Hi. Hey. <laughs> Amara, please. <laughs> you look so beautiful. Thank you. So tell honestly. me, what brings you to the city? <sighs> Amara, I came to look for work in the city. So, that's why I'm here. Mary the hustler. Mary, Mary. <laughs> you will not fail to amaze me. 
So hold on. <laughs> now it's no longer Pekere said. Hmm. You now want to graduate from Pekere to office work. Mm -hmm. Tell me, what kind of office do you think you can work in? Or can you work in a bank? Hmm. Amara, let me tell you. That Pekere girl used to know them. And the girl you're seeing in front of you is different. Please. I can see. Yes, I can work in a bank. I can work anywhere I want to work. <laughs> Can't you see I'm okay? I can see that already. <laughs> I can see that for myself. Please, what can I offer you? Ah, ah. You're a big woman now. So anything you want to offer me, offer me. I'm okay. Anything at all. Okay. Okay, I'll give you anything. <laughs> anything, I'm okay. <laughs> Mary! I'm so happy to Amara. see you. Amara! I'm happy to see you too! <laughs> oh my god! Wow! Where is that money ritualist? Huh? Can I go to Wagano? Can I go to Wagano? Okay, Wagano! You are the money ritualist! Okay, Wagano! You are the money ritualist! Okay, Wagano! I'm about to go! Puta! Where are you? Okay, Wagano! I say come out! Can I go? Yes? Okay, look at you. Okay, my nigga, how dare you? How dare you mess with my friend Uzochuku? Look at you! Hey, Buka. Are you alright? You're asking if I'm alright. I'm alright, oh! I'm very, very much alright. I'm very, very much sane. Let me tell you something. I don't care how you decided to help my friend, or why you decided to help him, or what you decided to get, or where you took me five minutes ago. But one thing I know is this. If anything happens to Uzochuku, I will not fail to tell the whole city how you will learn him into money rituals. What? What did you just say? Yes! You heard me right! Even the Mafuma, even no go go, my ritualist! Just keep quiet. What give you the gods to come into my house to raise your voice at me? You're insulting me. You're not scared. <laughs> scared of who? Scared of you! Okay, when I go, I'm not scared of you! I'm not afraid of you. Or when you fear my womb, I will tell you the truth. And the truth is what I'm telling you. Is it because of this little change you have? This little money that you're spending? Look at me very well. I'm a wise man. I'm a better man than you are. You are living in your father's glory. An ill-gotten wealth. Of course. With your attitude, I've seen how much of a wise man that you are. I have seen it. So you have the guts to open your mouth to insult me in my house. Man. Hey, okay, look, I did not come here to battle words with you. I came to warn you! If anything happens to Zochuku! Chelaka <laughs> Wolum! Don't underestimate me! Don't underestimate me! Why will I underestimate someone like you? Huh? I'm warning you! Okay! Okay! On your way! On your way! You're a ritualist! <laughs> okay, well, let go. <laughs> mm. My brother, I cannot thank you enough. Believe me, I want to thank you from the depths of my heart mm? for attending my, my, my traditional marriage. Yes, such a short notice considering how busy you are. I know you. Eh? Thank you. In fact, my wedding has become the talk of the town. It's everywhere, everywhere. <laughs> we are brothers now, hmm? and there is nothing I cannot do for you. You're my man. Woodwego. Woodwego. <laughs> see, you see this name you gave to me? The yeah. name is big, and it commands respect. Believe me, right now, anywhere I go, everybody will say, Woodwego, Woodwego, Woodwego. <laughs> everywhere, <laughs> even in my village, my king, small thing that I gave to him, he was shouting, Woodwego, Woodwego, Woodwego. <laughs> You see, that is what wealth can do. You should be expecting more of that to come. Udwego, you have arrived. Now you will test power and affluence. I can know even the small that I've tasted, I'm loving it already. I want to taste more. I want to keep tasting more. Hey! Oh, okay, Mulego, you are a true friend. I cannot thank you enough. What could I have done without you? What could I have done without you, King Walego? If not for you, I'll still be wallowing in poverty and wretchedness. Believe me, I'll still be living without my friend, whatever it is. Udwego, that reminds me. Do you know that your friend came to my house to threaten me? Huh? Yes. 
things. You know I don't like stress. But I was looking at him, I was just saying all oh, lots of things and everything. He's just a small boy. He's not even up to my level, my standard. I just left him. But I want you to help me mess him up. Fix him up for me. Hey. Hmm. Okay, where go? My man. Consider it done. I believe you. Where do I go? I believe you. Don't bother yourself. That, that idiot. Is he mad? Where do I go? Is he mad? <laughs> Don't leave that boy. Leave that boy. I know you will fix him up. So small. I'm angry. So small. I don't understand. Why did you bring me here? Huh? Is this one of your lands? How dare you? Huh? How dare you threaten my friend Okemwenego? Are you mad? Why? I don't understand. Ozo, if Okemwenego is your friend, then more. Who am I? Eh? Who am I to you? You are my enemy. That is what you are, my enemy. I'm your enemy? Yes. Ozo, just look at yourself. Look at what money has done to you. Neifego Mezege, you've changed. Ozo, you've sold your soul to the devil. And you'll never get it back. My friend, shut up there. Now don't worry, my friend. Shut up. Huh? Instead of you to come to me, speak to me like a friend. Beg me. Can't say again if I'm not going to say again if I'm not going to say again if I'm not going to You are wallowing in, 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 in poverty. Wretchedness. Moa, if you're going to say again if I'm not going to say again if I'm not going to say again if this is what if I'm not going to say again count me out. I'm not interested in materialism. My soul is priceless! Oh, shut up! I have sold my own soul to the devil. Hear me? And if selling my soul is the price I have to pay to be this rich, then so be it. I do not regret it. But what I will not take from you is you insulting a man who made me who I am today. When you did nothing for me, you are nothing. You are nobody. Oh, you know? Nothing! Oh, yeah? Yes. Also, listen to me and listen to me very good. Read my lips. I will not fail to tell everyone who cares to listen how Okemwelego lured you into his court. The man is a courtist and everyone is aware of that. That is exactly what I've been trying to tell you. And since you failed to listen to me, I will expose you, all of you. Nonsense! Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm only just trying to make this thing good for, for you. Everything is for you. You're doing this for for more. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Back. Oh yes, oh yes. So sorry I came back late again. I had so much work to do. I'm so tired. I've told you to get a manager that will be helping you out. Hmm? Oh yes, you've always said that, but you know, people are no longer trustworthy these days, I'm telling you so. I just uh, I find out that I have to do practically everything myself. You no. Know? But not to worry, I have a plan. Once you're done with school, you come join me in my workplace. <laughs> you know I would love that so much. Oh my god. <laughs> I missed you. I missed you too. I missed you too. <laughs> um, mm. That reminds me. Mm. The police were here today. Mm -hmm. Police? Yes. They said you have to report first thing tomorrow morning at the station. What for? 
that is in connection with your friend um, Ibuka. Yes, Ibuka. <coughs> By the way, who is Ibuka? Huh? Ibuka, I, I don't... Uh, it's... Oh, 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 Ibuka. Ah, Ibuka, my, my good friend. The guy I was staying uh, in, in his place when I came to the city. Yeah. Oh. Oh yeah. The guy you told me about. Oh, yes, yes, nice oh, okay. guy. Um, well, I'm wondering why the police would. Maybe he works with the police now or something. Don't stress your head over that. By the time you get to the station tomorrow morning, you'll find out. For now, you would have to come upstairs with me, take a shower, and then, you know. <laughs> Mama, Ebuka's death is very shocking and painful. If not for Ozo's tight schedule, I'm sure he should have been here by now. But he just asked me to come and tell you people. Ah, this is sad though. This is very sad. Eh? Um, has the police got hold of the murderer? Mm, Ozo said the police are on investigations for now. He's planning a befitting burial for Ebuka. You know he's very, very good and benevolent to him. He was the one that accommodated him in the city, remember? I know, I know. Mm. It's well. I know. When they face the burial, tell us of to tell us so that we will come and sympathize with the family. Um, how is Uzo, my brother? Yeah, he's very, very fine. Um, even he asked me to give this to you, Mama. Okay. Okay, thank you, Mom. Uh, Mama, I will take my leave now. Yeah? Okay. Yeah, Alright. Thank you. With my brother for me. I will. Bye, bye. Mama. Ebuka. Mama, Ebuka just like that. I pity the mother. Hi. Hi. So you bad. know Uzo, my son, is always talking about this Ebuka. The only name you will hear Uzo sing is Ebuka, Ebuka, Ebuka this, Ebuka that. Why would he just die like that? Like a common chicken. Ah, this is too bad. This is too bad. This is... Huh. God, why? How? Oh. Yeah, what is it? I'm not happy. <laughs> You're not happy? Uh, didn't you see the doctor? I did. But the result is still negative. No. I'm not pregnant. Huh. Yeah. Okay, now you won't kill yourself. That's not why you should be sad. I shouldn't be sad. Mm -hmm. It's been two years, Uzo. Two years since we got married, yet no show. No, there will be show. Hmm? Very soon there will be show. It's just a matter of time. We're still young. It, our marriage is still, you know, young. It's early. We're going to have a child. Uzo, you don't understand. People are already talking. They're already wagging their tongue about me being barren. And I'm scared very soon your family might join them. I don't care about my family. I don't care about them. Neither do I care about what people say. Okay? What matters is that I love you. I love you very much. You are mine and you'll be mine forever. At God's appropriate time, He will give us children. Hmm? But why is God taking so long? Why is he not answering me? Okay. Okay. <laughs> I've prayed, I've fasted. What have I done? I want a child. I have many reasons to be happy. 
unfulfilled. But I'm not happy. I'm not happy. One thing is making me very unhappy. And that is the issue of childlessness. Fribo, you have said the same thing to me before. And I told you to give it time. How much time? How much time will I give? Is it when I die that I'll start having children? How much time? Eh? See, I can't... Eh, you will not understand. My, my wife is giving me a headache. My wife will not rest. She keeps crying about this thing every night. Talking to me as if I'm not a man. I can't, I can't fire. Eh? Madam, when we fear the fight, come on. My brother, to be frank with you, I am surprised. I don't know why you turned out like this. Why, why is your case different? Look at me, I have four kids. I used one for sacrifice. Yeah. I still have three. It's okay, you see now. They are doing very well with Bright Future. You see, exactly my point. With Bright Future. So why will my own be different? I mean, I don't understand. I'm ca Chapolo, okay, well, let go. Let go. See, me, I'm a guy, yo. Huh? Man to man, talk to me like a man. What a, a guy. A boom guy. Is there anything you did not tell me about this whole this thing? Is there something you did that me I didn't do? Why would you ask me that kind of question? I've been open to you from the beginning. Are you sure? No, no, no. Hey, so why is my own different now? Why can't I have children? I don't know. I am even surprised and confused at the same time. Listen, I think you need to channel this question to the Grandmaster. I am having this feeling that there's a problem somewhere. I don't, I don't know. Seriously. Okay, well, there you go. Rigo, don't give me that look. I am telling you the truth. Okay, where well, there you go. My lord, I come to you with a troubled heart. Speak for Aquaba, the Manchester of Hall is listening. Thank you. It's about this issue of childlessness. For three years, three years I have been married. No issue. No pregnancy. Not even a miscarriage. So I want to know, can even a man? Then she is barren. No, no. My wife cannot be barren. It's not possible. I mean, over the past few weeks, I've had um, intercourse with different women. And none of them has come to me to say that she is pregnant. You know, I, I'm, I'm wondering, my, the sacrifice I made for my wealth, did it involve my potency as a man? Of course, you are fit to procreate. For it is through your seed you will be making periodic sacrifice to Aquila. Of course, I understand the rules. That, so I want to know, can even I mess it? I mean, it, 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 somehow my wife is disturbing me. I, 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 don't, I, don't, I don't sleep. All because I cannot father a child. I want to get here. Well, I will have to find out what really went wrong. For Aquila's blessings are without misfortune. <sighs> Look at this. about this. 
You have reported to the police. This is two weeks now. And there is no sign of the child. I want you to assume that the child is gone. Just pray for another, okay? Elisa! Pray for another child after how many years of marriage? Eh? After at this age? Eh? At this age? Eh? Um. You will still have another child. Please. Obiko. Cool. Ah! God! Oh God! I know how many years I have wept. I cried, begged you for a child. And you allowed the enemies to take this war from me. Ah! 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 Whosoever is responsible for the disappearance of my child, that person will never hear the cry of a baby in this household. That person will never hear the cry of a child. In this generation, that person will look for solution far and near. A solution will not come. That person will die a slow and shameful death. Now you have seen the reason for the childlessness. Oh, come on. Great Akweba, I do not know that woman. It was my boys who kidnapped her. How can I cross her? Of course, you are behind everything. And so the responsibility will be on you. At least you now know the reason for your childlessness. Hey. Hey. The great one. That is why I'm here. That is why I am your disciple. Help me to break free from this curse. I cannot make all the money in the world only for me not to have an offspring. A child I will call my own, who will take after me, who will enjoy the money. Help me. It will be very difficult. The woman's spirit is very strong. And even the heaven had a voice. Wait. Are you saying there is nothing you have ever can do to fix this? <laughs> Oh, there's something that can be done. Uh, Akweba is the mightiest of all and can break every cause. But it will be very, very difficult. Very, very difficult. At least now we know the reason for your misfortune. I, I can't do it. Oh no, no, no. Believe me, I can't. I, I can't do it. I, I love her so much. I, I can't. Udwego, I understand. But you see, the choice is yours. But I know that your life is more important. Oh God. Oh, I feel so disappointed and... and I'm confused right now. I don't know what to do. You know, I feel like exhuming the, the corpse of that woman. I just, I feel like strangling her again. What kind of rubbish is this? You are dead, you are dead. Leave me alone. But it's unfortunate that can happen. I think you need to do what is required of you now. So you won't lose everything. This coming Sunday is Mother's Day. I'll go to my village and see my mother. After that, I'll think of what to do. All right. But whatever you do, remember at the back of your mind, you don't have time. Hey. One day, I'll be on my way.
Honey? Uh, honey, you're still awake. Mm, I... <clears throat> I've not been able to sleep since you woke me up for prayers. So why didn't you join me in the room for the prayers? Too many things on my mind. Just needed to be alone for a while, I think. Honey, I know you're worried about this childless situation. And I'm worried too. But all we have to do is just give it to God in prayers. Worry will not solve anything. Yes, I know, but I'm, I'm just confused. You know, I don't, I don't know the next action to take. I'm so confused. <laughs> anyway, uh, this Sunday is Mother's Day. I'll be going to the village to see. Hey, hey. I'm coming, I'm coming, baby, I'm coming with you. No, no. That will not be necessary. You'll go during Christmas. <laughs> yeah. I know the moment we get into the village, people will start talking. I wouldn't want anybody to insult you, insult us, okay? I believe that at God's appropriate time, He will give us children. Hmm? Amen. You have a point, though. We'll get some rest, though. I'll join you later. Just know that I miss you, okay? I'm waiting. Of the mama. Yes, mama. Or the quiz. Hey! Eh! Hey! Over a mama. Okay, mama. My son. As if you knew that the one I had is already old. Oh, your mama. Where is your mama? Oh, your mama. Come, 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 come. Hey! What is why all this noise? What See the rapper my son bought for me. Offending the mom. I didn't please it. My son bought for Modern Sunday. <laughs> hey! Okay. For Modern Sunday. Is it only your mommy's rapper that Ozo brought back from the city? This is the only thing Amara gave to me. This is the only thing she gave to me. Again. So you're not happy for me? You're not happy for me? Only yes, anyway. Who is at home? Who's up? Someone is here. Jesus. Father, are you all right? What is what's the problem? What do you want? Uh, my name is Oke, but you can call me Oke Virego. I am a friend to your husband. In fact, I'm your husband's best friend. Well, my husband is not home right now. Okay. Um, I mean, from the look of things, it's like you do not even recognize me. I mean, I was present in your wedding, but no problem. Um, when he comes back, tell him that okay, very go ask of him. Hmm? I try to call him, but his number is not going through, so I decided to stop by. Hmm? Um, I'll, I'll be on my way. Yes. Uh, but, madam, are you sure you are fine? Um. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm fine. But... But what? Never mind. Goodbye. Alright. Take care of yourself. Hmm? Bye. Your friend 
was here to see you. He said his name is Oke. Oh, Oke okay, Molego. Oke. Okay. That's what he called himself. But there's something very strange about that young man. The moment, the moment I looked at him, I saw a demon. Excuse me, demon. See, I don't understand what you're talking about. Obi, I'm very serious. I am very, very serious. There seems to be this darkness hovering around him. I can't really place my hand on it, but please, you have to be very careful. Be very, very careful around that young man, please. All right, I heard you. Be careful. Uzochuk, I'm not joking. Yeah. He seems evil. Is it possible we don't have this discussion again? Huh? Please. He's my friend. My good friend. So I wouldn't want you to speak ill of him. Please. That's enough. Go get me something to eat. She saw a demon in me. Yes. And I'm wondering why my wife would say such a thing about you. Why? I, I, I don't know why, but I am so surprised. Why would she look at me and see some? Uh, but I hope this will not bring any problem between the both of you. No, no, I don't think so. My problem is, why would my wife look at you deep into your eyes and then tell me to avoid you. Is there something I'm, I do not know? Why? I am so confused. I am confused. But you see, you're the man here. Women are women. There's a way you can always brainwash her. Yes, you know, make her feel like she has lost her mind. Probably suggest a medical visit for her. Because there's absolutely no way she will find out that would belong to something dark. <laughs> no, no, bro, don't. Don't go there at all. Don't call it something dark. I mean, any movement that could rejuvenate me and bring me back to life, make me the man I am today, that movement cannot be darkness. It is light. <laughs> I like the fact that that is coming from you. Good. Um, the sacrifice. What do you have in mind? Mm, that sacrifice. That sacrifice. A bad situation or color ugliness, you want them Nobody in a no quiet. Well, I'm not to my no, see, I get up from my walk. My dear. I just wish my brother would take the same step us or took. Could you imagine us that just left village a few months ago and suddenly turned to millionaire? <laughs> Wonder shall never end in me. <laughs> Dear, I'll be telling you that all that glinters are not good. So what are you saying in essence? Who's all wet is being questionable. Don't you think so? I don't want to know. I don't want to know. I don't care. That's your business. Ah, my business. When the money comes, like the one comes in my trunk. Ah, yeah. Okay. Where should we go? Obioma, you're not coming to church with me. I'm, I'm tired. You're tired and you're here drinking pan wine. Hey, Obioma. Why have we chosen to, to end your life like this? Or is it Nemesis catching up with you? What are you talking about? And the way you drink pan wine these days is suspicious. Look at you. Look, just look at yourself. Yeah? Other men in this village, 
They are preparing to go to church with their wife today, being modern Sunday. Look at it. And they are here drinking pan wine. Enough. I said enough. Hmm. I will not sit here and listen to you say all that rubbish in my face. And what will you do? Obioma, I'm asking you, what will you do? What? Please allow me to enjoy my pan wine. Happy Mothering Sunday. Yes, what do you want from me? Oh my god! So you are alive! It's me, your brother, Onyema. I know who you are, and what do you want from me? Everybody thought you are dead. But how come? I actually saw your corpse. Yes, I am dead. And he killed me. Who killed you? Is he your husband? He killed me. You will find out soon and stay away from me. So, so what killed my sister? So what killed my sister? No, Obi your must tell me who, who killed my sister today. Obi your must tell me. No, no, sister, no! Sister, no! Oh my God! So it was a dream. It was a dream. But why she? Why would she be so angry? But why would she be be telling me to stay away from her? Why would she be warning me to stay away from her? I still don't understand. I don't understand. So someone killed her. Uh, someone killed her. No. I must find her killer. I must find out who killed her. Could it be Obioma? No. 
I must find her killer. I must find her killer. Who's our chicken? Please calm down. Please calm down all your anger and let us resolve this amicable. Please. No, let him kill me. I'm the evil one in your mix. Let him kill the man that just lost his wife. You didn't just lose your wife. You killed your wife. You killed our mother. Who fed you with that lie? Bro, lie. Bro, lie. I was told. They caught you red-handed. Someone, somebody told me that both of you were arguing. I don't know what you did to, 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 to our mother. And then she died. And you are lying. Now you did to our mother. Own up. Who's up, please? Eh? Let the elders handle this issue. And stop accusing Papa. You don't have any proof. My family, you shut up there. Shut up! You'll always support him. Elders, this man, Moka not here, this man, he killed our mother. Let him just own up. He did. I know him too well. That is enough. We are here to solve the issue and not to aggravate it. Neither you allow us to handle this, Zochuku, or we leave you and your father to do whatever you like to him. See, oh. see, uh, uh, okay, I'm, I'm very sorry. I'm sorry, but I can't just take it now. Uh -uh. He, he never liked anybody in our family. I didn't, I, I didn't know he would go this far to the extent of killing my own eye. Killing my own mother. And you people are telling me to stay. You won't. Nah. Mr. Chiku, we have come to a conclusion after much deliberation on this matter. We have decided to take your father to the shrine, to swear before Okwama is innocent in his wife's death. Exactly. And that is the only solution to this unwanted situation. I am ready to take the oath whenever you people are ready. Despite the fact that it's against my religion, I am a bona fide Christian. Someone kill my wife. I believe you have the best answer to that question. Obioma. Someone killed my sister. Someone killed my sister. And that someone will never go unpunished. I am as a vengeance. Onyema, I don't know what you are talking about. Even though my wife died in my arms, I am innocent. Onyema. Let me ask you, why is my son Ozochuku accusing me? Obioma, whether you are guilty or not guilty is none of my business. The reason I'm here is to inform you that I have sought for a solution to this. I am required to pass some sand from my grave to Amoguchi Rhine, where her true killer will be ascertained. Whatever you want to do, go ahead. I am not going to stop you. Mm -hmm. But I would like to tell you one thing. I am innocent. You are innocent. You are innocent, right? Yet you quarrel almost every time. You are innocent. Can you hear yourself? It's okay, no problem. But let me tell you, soon, I mean soonest, the arms of the fowl will open. It will open. The truth must be revealed. You are innocent. Stay with your innocence. Nonsense. Stay with your innocence. Amarachi, my father can never kill my mother. I refuse to believe that. Uh -uh. My father can't kill my mother now. I don't believe this either. I don't. But the oath is the only thing that will exonerate him. Listen, Nikem, I know he's against our Christian belief, but let him just take the oath. Just to prove his innocence. 
But why will anybody kill my mother? Eh? What did she do? My mother was a very peaceful woman. I know. Her death left a very serious blow on all of us. Especially my husband who is yet to get over this. He rarely does anything apart from crying. Mm. He doesn't even sleep at night. Oh. My poor brother. But Inkem, there's something else I want to talk to you about. What is that? It's about my husband and the type of friends he keeps. What type of friends? There's this very friend of his that I don't really like. In fact, I don't like him at all, Inkem. Let me be honest with you. He looks evil. And there is this darkness hovering around him whenever he comes around. Okay, I think he might hurt my husband. God forbid! God forbid! Nothing will ever happen to my brother. Amen. You know what? We need to step fast in our prayers. The enemies are not happy with this family. But you know what? The good Lord we serve will disappoint them. Amen. Amarachi, we need to say a little prayer. Okay. Don't mind my... I don't mind. I don't mind. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen! In heaven, we thank you. We glorify your name because... Obi, Ama, take this and swear. Swear! I, Obi Oma, a true son of this land, hereby swear that if I have a hand in the death of my wife, may Akwama, the gods of our ancestors, unleash his anger on me. Hey! My eye! Hey! Hey! My eye! Hey! My eye! You see it? My eye! You fool, yeah? You see it? I said it. I said it that this man is a murderer. I said it. He killed my uh, uh, mother. He, he, okay for you. I was saying he would never believe me. See it? Wicked man. Papa. Uncle, when are you? Papa, how could you have done this? How? What did Mama do to you? Hi. Obi, Oma. You should have killed your wife. Mama. I can't see. I can't see. That peaceful woman. Just, just look at the shame and disgrace you brought upon yourself and the family. Oh. Just, just look at you. I will deal with this man. Let's go. Hey. Let's go. Who did this to me? My eye. I can't see. Obi-Oma. Like bunch of disgrace. My eye. My eye. Hey, who did this to me? Why me? Hey, wonder shall never end. Have you seen it for yourself? I told you Mas Obi-Oma is evil. I think he has been playing our intelligence with Desemo. Buchi, I am so surprised. Uh, but even at that, I don't seem to see Mazi Obioma as evil as villagers see him. Why Obioma? I don't know you are such a doubt. After the whole thing that happened at the shrine, stand there, keep following his self-imagination. Buchi, let's continue doing this. Uzochiku, do you want me to banish your father instantly? Tell me and I will just do that. No, no, no. Don't banish him. Don't banish him. Let him just remain there. I want villagers to be coming every day. Eh? Let them be seeing him. I want them to mock him. Let them mock him. I want him to receive all the humiliation possible. You know? Let them, let them insult him very well for, for, for killing an innocent woman. Hmm? It's alright. It's alright. I am very sorry for the loss of your mother. Please accept my sympathy. You don't know the pain I feel, honestly. Mona, my mother had the car. We were so close, and this, this wicked man just wasted her for nothing. It's okay, Igwe. Thank you very much. Thank you. It's all right. I just said, let me come and pay homage. Eh? Oh, yeah, okay. You're yeah, welcome. Right. I'll take my leave, man. It's all right. All right. You were... Your food is here, Papa. I'm not hungry. Please now, Papa. You've not eaten for the past two days. I said I am not hungry. That's a lie. 
Do you want to starve yourself to death? Is it not better than being accused of what I didn't do? Huh? Okay. Let me ask you. Do you believe them? I don't know what to believe anymore, Papa. I was in the shrine when you went blind. Though I am blind, I am very innocent of what they are accusing me of. Believe me. I'm sorry, Papa. But everyone in the village thinks you did it. I trusted you. I never allowed anyone condemn you. But you disappointed me, Papa. Don't worry, my daughter. I will prove to you and everyone in this village that I did not kill your mother. I am innocent. How are you going to do that now that you're blind and helpless? Because he's your father, and you need him now that Mama is gone. Rubbish. He's not my father. That man is a murderer, and I do not want to have anything to do with him. Never. Then what makes you a Christian if you can't forgive? <sighs> Obi, listen. I know Papa did something very terrible. But condemning him is not the best option. What are you talking about? You want me to welcome him with open arms, so he can come in here and kill me? Like he killed my mother, is that what you're saying? For God's sake, we're talking about a harmless old blind man here. <sighs> he needs our support, please. Enough. In fact, we're done with this discussion. Okay, I do not want to hear anything about this again. That man is a murderer and I'm going to deal with him severely for, for killing my mother. Enough. Sometimes you're just so impossible. Obioma, my in-law. Um, Obioma. Honestly, I am so sorry of accusing you of having a hand in my sister's death. Honestly, I am deeply sorry. Did you find her to kill her? Yes, of course. Yes. So, so who is it? Uh, it's no other person than someone you know already. But I am sad to break this to you. In fact, I was shocked and heartbroken when I was told it's him. Onyema, my in-law. Please talk to me. Why are you speaking in tongues? Who killed my wife? Who put me in this misery? No, Papa. I refuse to believe that. Uh -uh. My daughter. I even find it so difficult myself to believe. In fact, I think that man was drunk when he said Uzo Chuku, my brother, is responsible for Mama's death. It's not possible now. Eh? It is so strange. Eh? I even asked him very well, over and over. Yet he maintained that Uzo Chuku, my son, killed your mother. Umba now. Chuku Aju. Ah -ah. Uzo, my brother. And Papa, so what do we do about this problem? Okay. There's a place you will take me to. It's very important. A place? Yes, just just you and I. Great Akweba. I've been invited by my people to take an oath of innocence concerning my mother's death. 
I thought they already know who killed your mother. I do not understand. My, my, my father. My father told them that I have something to do with my mother's death. And so everybody wants me to take the oath. Oath? So go and take the oath. Mm -hmm. Yes, go and take the oath. Ah. Mm, no. I'm scared. Believe me, I'm afraid. My, I don't trust anybody. My enemies know that they will try to do everything possible to, to rubbish my reputation, to bring me down. Oh, you are afraid? <laughs> Your detractors will plan something against you that day. Yes. Oh, yes. It seems you don't know what it means to be a descendant of Akuba. You have nothing absolutely to be afraid of. Go and take the oath. Go and take the oath. Uh, yes, go and take the oath. My God! Hi! The God I serve, please hear my cry. You can tell me the truth. Do you believe my husband has a hand in your mother's death? Do you? Amara, I'm surprised at you. How could you ask me that? You know how well my brother loved my mother. So why will he have a hand in, 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 in her death? Then what is going on? What is going on? Why the sudden accusation? Why in came? It's my uncle, though. But let's just wait till my brother returns from the shrine. <laughs> Kim, I'm not comfortable. I'm not comfortable at all. I'm cold. I don't know why I have this ill feeling about this particular oath. I'm not comfortable, Kim. I'm not. It's our people's way of exonerating the innocent. So, and that you already know, so I don't know why you're panicking. Just don't worry. He will return. I don't understand what is going on. I don't know what is going on. Uz has totally changed. It's as if I'm marrying a stranger. He no longer talks to me. We no longer talk like we used to. He doesn't tell me anything. Do you blame him? All of this is getting on him. I just wish it could be over so that you know, we can have peace again. The God I serve, hear my cry. What is the meaning of this? What are you doing to a man that just lost his wife? A man who killed his wife. A man who killed his wife. You've been telling everybody that I killed our mother. Okay? Just because, just because you want to look innocent. Right? Fine. I now accepted to go to that shrine and swear. And I swore. What happened? You see me? I'm still alive. Hail and hearty. What happened to you? You swore and you went blind. Why? Because you are the culprit. Ibu, our mother. You, wicked man. Uzochuku, you know you did. You killed your mother. And I believe your uncle and the native doctor. No problem. Who told me you did. Okay? No problem. That is why these guys are here. I brought the police. You will take them to that native doctor. Both of you will rot in jail. Guys, move him. Officer, Officer, please. Officer, please. Officer, Officer, please. Officer, please. Officer, please. Officer, please. Officer, please. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Papa, oh. hey. Hey. what is going on? Hey, Papa, oh. <laughs> hey, what's <laughs> up? Hey, Amara, I need to go to the palace. Amara, I'm going to go. Igwe, Igwe. What is going on? <laughs> your Highness, Your Highness, Your Highness, I need your help. Doctor, what is it? It's my brother Uzo. He brought police to the house to arrest my father. I've heard about it. 
you should know that your brother acted in anger. Your father is trying to tarnish his image. Your Highness, my father has gone through worse things since he became blind. Putting him in a police cell only was in everything. Your father deserves whatever pain he's going through right now for killing your mother. Yes, if not for your brother's wish, I would have banished him from this land. Your father has soiled his hands. He has killed. There's nothing I can do about it. Your Highness, are you not telling me that there is nothing you can do to stop my brother or make him release my father from the police cell? There is nothing I can say or do that can stop him. Better still, you can go to him. He's your brother. Plead with him. Maybe we'll listen to you. So doesn't listen. He will not listen. You are You just have to help me, please. I'm sorry. There's nothing I can do about it. Good. What, what would you push Obioma to go and kill his own wife? His action is very, very grievous. I wonder what would you push him to go and kill his own wife? It is totally unacceptable. <sighs> What, 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 what's wrong with you? What's the meaning of this? I have come for you to arrest me the same way you arrested Papa. What nonsense are you saying? I will confess to the villagers that I killed Mama. If that is the price I will pay for Papa to come out of cell, then so be it. My friend, will you shut up? You will do no such thing. Why are you always covering that man? He, 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 he's a murderer. Though he's a murderer, but he's still our father. We can't just push him away like that now. And so? So if he's, a, if, if he's our father, he'll do something bad, we'll cover if, if If it was me, will, will he do the same thing for me? No way. He is a murderer. He will rot in jail. Simple. No problem. I will do my confession neatly tomorrow morning. You will do no such thing. Uzo, wash me do I this. said you will do no... Wash me! Yeah, you can come back here. You can... My friend, come back here! You can... You told me that in less than three months, I will hear the good news. I'm waiting. Patience is a rare virtue. You must adopt. No, I'm going on patience are now. I'm running out of patience. I'm, I'm losing it. Help me. What of Okewerego? I've not seen him in days now. Fetch him. Fetch him. I have something for the both of you. Uh, does it have to do with my, my, my request? I told you to be patient. Go and do as I said. I'm sorry. Peter Kuiba. I'll fetch him right here. Okay, my daughter. I was so surprised when the police let me go. What made your brother change his mind? I thought he was going to allow me to rot in there. I had to threaten him that I was going to tell all the villagers about how I killed Mama so that I can be arrested. You were ready to do such thing? Yes, Papa. If that is all it takes for you to be out of cell, I was ready to do anything. I couldn't sleep knowing that you're in there suffering upon your blindness. I only spoke what Onyema told me. 
and your brother did this to me. I am beginning to believe that all the allegation against him is true. Papa, are you saying that Uzo Chuku, my brother, killed Mama? Okay, my daughter. It is only a matter of time. The truth will be unedited. A son who can do this to his father is capable of doing anything. Yeah, wicked man. I see you are out from the cell and already you are bonding with your daughter. But don't worry, it will only be temporary because I will not rest until I tell the whole world, expose you to the whole world and tell them that you are a murderer. You will not rest. Brother Uzo, when will you drop this? Has the ghost not taken vengeance on him by making him blind? Why not let him be? I will not let him be. And why are you always supporting him? I'm not supporting anything. You have mocked him enough. It's time for him to be cleaned up. He's our father, you know. He is not our father. He may be your father, but he is not mine. And I'm here to take you to the city. You hear me? This, this, this wicked man does not deserve to be with anybody until the gods are done with the punishment that they are giving to him. Let's go. I'm not leaving Papa. I'm not going anywhere. Papa, say something. Now, why are you silent to this matter? Say something. What do you want him to say? He's a murderer. What do you talk about? My daughter, it doesn't matter what I say or do. Kuzochuku, do whatever you want with me. Look, I can... You wicked uncle of mine. What are you doing here? Huh? After accusing me falsely, you have the guts to, to walk into this compound. Why? Yes, that is exactly what we are about to do. We are about to prove if my accusation is right or not. What rubbish are you saying? Uzochiku, we are just coming from the Igwe's palace where we had a meeting with him concerning this very issue. We have decided you have to swear to under oath. Ma'am, me. Why? Give me the Eh? Are you people doing this thing intentionally just to, to, to be disturbing me? You were all there when I swore at that shrine and I was proved innocent. So why do you want to take me through that rigorous process again? Why? Uzo, you could listen to me. Listen. Listen to me. You will be taking this oath in armor shrine this time around. Why armor shrine? Because armor is the mother of all deities. <sighs> well, Amara, I don't know about you, but I quite agree with your husband's decision to punish your father-in-law for trying to rob him into his evil act. I mean, that man is so mean and wicked. My point is that my husband should just forgive his father. I mean, he can't just arrest him just like that. It's a shame to the family. Have you even imagined how the villagers will be spreading this news? <sighs> Amara, you have a point. But everybody knows the kind of man your father-in-law is. Everybody knows the kind of person he is. So don't see them blaming your husband too much for his actions. If I was in shoes, that's exactly what I would have done. Mary, you don't understand. I really wish you understood how much I want all this to go away. This is, this is not what I want for a family I'm married into. For God's sake, I already have one problem at hand. 
my childlessness. And now this. Amara, come on. You will soon face out all these things. Just be patient. Talking about your childlessness, there is nothing God cannot do. I've been hearing that. Come on. There is this man of God I know. You want to go check out for help? A very reliable one. He is. Please. When are we going? This is how we go. I'll give you his address. Pastor. How often do you pray with your husband? Um, not very often. We used to pray a lot before, but he stopped. Stopped as in? He no longer expressed his willingness to pray with me, especially since he lost his mother. Where is Sister Mara? From the revelation I had while I was praying with you, your husband is under a curse. A curse? Yes, and that is why he's impotent. Pastor, what are you saying to me? And the woman that cursed him is dead. And there is no redemption about it. But he can still be saved if only he's willing to atone for his sins. Man of God, please, can I atone on his behalf? No, you can't. How can you atone for a murderer? What did you just say? Well, Sister Mara, your husband belongs to a circle of darkness. And it's only prayer that can salvage you from this. Well, I'll pray for you. But you need to bring him here before it becomes late. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I have to go now. Yes, I slapped you, and I will slap you again and again if you don't stop accusing me wrongly. Can you hear me? What nonsense? I mean, how can you believe some, one, some a total stranger told you about me? He's a pastor. So? So you think he cannot lie? Huh? For your information, pastors lie. He must have told you that so he will not look fake to you. I don't know if I should believe you. I mean, how could I believe you when you've been acting well for these past few days? Listen to me. I am your wife. If you have anything to do with this mother, tell me. Who placed a curse on you? If you say that nonsense again, I will slap you. And you hear me? Nobody placed a curse on me. And I had nothing to do with any mother. Shut up! Okay. Let's assume I believe you. He asked me to bring you to him. So how about following me to the pastor so you can prove him wrong? So he can condemn me for that. Is that it? I will do no such thing. For your information, I'm supposed to go to the village this weekend to prove my innocence for the second time. And you, my wife, you're supposed to stand with me, not to stand against me. Discuss me. Get out of my sight. I'm sorry. Give me this 
day. I thank you, all Lord, for my family. I'm up for this moment, oh Lord, I come before thee. Father, I kneel before you. I come before your throne, thanks for your grace, oh Lord. I thank you and I recognize you as the author and finisher of my life, oh Lord. This moment I begin to commit myself into your mighty care, oh Lord. You promised in your word there will be no barren woman in the land. In Kamayadi, Nietzsche, Jehovah. Will my case be different? Give me a chance. <laughs> Give me my own child, oh Lord. I declare this night that any strong man, any strong woman holding my children, holding my womb, that in the mighty name of Jesus I begin to set a place in their kingdom. In the mighty name of Jesus I set them on fire. And it is my children this night, oh Lord. <laughs> I call it my husband, it's in my ticket. <laughs> I pray for such a good to you, O oh Lord. Certify him, O oh Lord. <laughs> Just like he's up 35, punch him with his soap. <laughs> so he can just write that snow, O oh Lord. <laughs> Yeah, my cry. No one ever caused any man or woman have laid upon him. It is my to the of Jesus I begin to break all causes. It is my to the of Jesus. Nobody situation or call ugliness you want no more. Nobody Uh-huh. Thank you very much. Hold this one. What about my wife? Okay, she went to see her people. She will soon be back. Um, brother? Yeah? When is the old taking ceremony? Holding? Oh, tomorrow. Tomorrow. I can't wait. Honestly, I can't wait to get it over with. So I can prove to my enemies that I'm innocent. Let them know I had nothing to do with Mama's death. Okay? Um, brother? Mm -hmm. As your only sister, mm -hmm. Is there something I should know? I mean, is there something you're not telling me? And where is that coming from? Wait, 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 Inkem. Are you also suspecting me? No, no, I'm not. It's just that there are some things your wife told me about you. My wife told you? That's it. That is it. I am done with her. I'm done with that woman. I, I'm, I, I'm getting a divorce. I cannot live with a woman who goes about insulting me, make, making a mockery of me, t talking bullshit about me in public. No! It has gotten to it, my friend. Ah, what kind of rubbish? I'm not on one. I'm, I'm, she's my wife, for God's sake. She can't go around and be insulting me. On, 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 yala. I'm done with her. And I'm also done with you. Take your food out of here. This food is very sweet. You will like it. I'm walking to you. Get out of here! Then, Step forward. I want you to take a moment and think about what you are about to do. The consequences. There is no coming back from it. Thank you. I have thought about it. And I know that I am innocent. Let us get this over and done with so I can prove to the whole world that I am innocent. I will shame my enemies today. I don't have time. Let's go. <laughs> we get it. Amogu is the mother of all deities and shows no mercy to the guilty. Nothing is hidden from her. I mean nothing. So, this is your last chance to consider a retrace of your step before going ahead with this. Wise one, I am innocent. I've told you, I don't have time. Let's do this thing so I can go. I'm a very busy man. Let's go. Very well then. Hold this. And swear your innocence before the great Amogu. 
Great Amogu, I am innocent of the accusations leveled against me. I had nothing to do with the death of my mother. If I have lied, Great Amogu, do with me whatever you wish. Well, it is done. Thank you. You see it. You see it, wicked people. You see it. Baby, are we forget? Yes. Haven't I proved them wrong? You Can have? you see? I told you people, this this man, this wicked man is the person that killed our mother. Nea, blind man. Have I gone blind now? Can you see? I can still see. Has he killed me? Wicked people. Baby, I don't. Hey, 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 I will confess on this. Don't kill me, please. Hey. Ah, yeah. I will confess, please. Please, I will confess. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. I will confess. Oh, this is how it all started. You go. Confess. These are the clothes I want to give to her for the forthcoming Mother's Sunday. You have done well by bringing it. Um, take it. It is done. I don't understand. Give her the wrapper. Once she put it on, her life will no longer be ours, but ours. Just like that? Yes, just like that. Akweba will be pleased of this sacrifice. And I assure you, in three months' time, your wife shall conceive. For it requires only blood sacrifice to cleanse you of this monumental cause you bear. Go, give her the wrapper. It is done. I'll be looking forward to hearing the news of her death once I give her this. It's true, I killed her. I killed her and the only way to cover it up was to accuse Papa. I arranged with Aquama Chief Priest to make Papa blind so that everybody would think that it was Papa that killed her mother. But I did it, it's true, I did it, I killed her. It was when I started experiencing childlessness. I started looking for solutions, any solution at all to fix my problem. That was when I got into this. Please hey. forgive me. My sister would have been the next person to die hey. if this situation had not intervened. Forgive me, oh people. Hey. What's that, Choko? So you killed my wife. Papa, forgive me. And you lied against me. That means the pastor was right. He told me the truth. Me, <laughs> you killed your mother Zachuku because of money. Forgive me. Forgive me. I also killed my friend Ebuka because he wanted to expose my late friend Okenwelego. Yes. Hey. I used an infant for rituals. That's how I became so rich. So rich. But I couldn't have a child because the baby's mother cost me. Hey. Forgive me. My wife, forgive hey. me. Please, Papa, forgive me. Hey, I can see. Huh? You, you can see. Hey. Ilo. Hey. You mean you can see? Kite is back. Hey. I can see. Well, can you yes, see yes. Can you Very see? well, Omar. I can see you. Hey. Hey. Oh, I can Chief see you. Please, please. Give, me hey. back. Give me back my hey. own sight. Thank please. God. Chief, please. Thank God. Finally, please. I have been vindicated. Oh, God, I thank you. Please, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. So 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 Give me back my own sight, oh, please. What's that, Chuku? Huh? I should forgive you. So I can see, please. Huh? Take this. Huh? Hey, Papa. Father, be cool. Don't, do, don't do this. To. Don't do this. Please. Papa, where are you don't going do this. to? Please forgive me. Papa, forgive me, please. Chief Is priest, please do something. Chief priest, please do something. Chief priest, be cool. Hey, hey, it's painful, oh, it's painful. Hey, Papa, do something. Nobody ask me. Nobody ask me. Yeah, 